You're watching New York One News All Morning. Living Health and Fitness Report. Video games have come a long way since Space Invaders. Now One is helping the visually impaired get in on the game of life. New York One Health Reporter Kapit Rexel explains how the Wii is breaking down barriers using its motion tracking technology. It's yet another use for Wii technology. Instructors at the Jewish Guild for the Blind are testing out a new device called the Wii Cane to see if it can help improve mobility training and cane use in young children. One of the greatest challenges for an O&M instructor, which I am, orientation and mobility, is trying to teach a student to travel and walk outdoors in a safe, cell, you know, in a safe line, in a, in a straight line. So the Wii Cane is like a super idea where it's a, it's a great indoor training device to have our students get the feeling of what it feels like to veer and how independently at real time how to correct that situation. The training tool is being developed by the New York City based design team Touch Graphics. It uses Wii motion tracking technology to help students get the feel for not only walking in a straight line but practicing turns. A computer receives movement data and dings if the student remains on track or moves in the right direction. Evidence shows that once learned those skills are translatable into actual outdoor travel and that's huge because then people walk crossing a street won't veer in, into oncoming traffic and lots of other things uh, in their in the course of their independent travel that where they need that ability to uh, to continue walking in a straight line without a lot of external uh, Information. The Wii Cane training program isn't meant to replace traditional training methods, just to supplement them. And instructors here say if there's one thing for certain kids respond to computers, and they're seeing responses in training in some of them that they haven't quite seen before. Some of the students are really getting off of it. They keep talking about it. They can't wait to come back and to hold on to the cane, work the receivers, and manipulate their bodies through space to get to see if they can walk the straight line. The Wii Cane is also being developed for adults who are new cane users. It's expected to be available for commercial use by January 2011. In Manhattan, Kafi Drexel, New York One.